This guy discovered a World War II treasure chest buried in his yard. One thing we cannot say about yard work is that it's exciting. Usually, the only thing we can dig up from our yard is an old bone dug by our dog. The only exciting thing about that is if the dog starts fighting us for the bone. But as it happens, things can turn exciting in a yard. At least, they can if you live in a place that was once part of Soviet Russia. There was a great deal of conflict there once and people took to hiding their stuff to keep them safe. This is what happened to one man called Lukachev Dmitri. This guy was doing some yard work. Technically, he was trying to dig a hole to plan for his new outhouse. Thanks to this digging, Dmitri would find a gift from history. Dmitri's summer house is situated in Besh Kungoy, Kyrgyzstan. This town was once part of Soviet Russia. It's here that Dmitri found a metal box that contained objects that were more than 70 years old. It started when Dmitri was digging and he hit something hard. At first, the guy thought it was a rock. Digging a bit deeper, however, and with a bit of persistence, Dmitri learned that what he was hitting was no rock. Rather, it was a metal chest. The latter would prove to be more than just a metal box, however. It was a treasure chest, carrying objects dating back to World War II. The box was lifted to the surface, Dmitri explained. It was not very heavy, but judging by the sounds, there was something inside clattering while the box was being pulled out of the hole. The box was perfectly sealed and it needed tools to be pried open. So Dmitri got his tools to open the metal box. When he finally opened the box, he couldn't believe what he saw. He realized that he had a time capsule buried in his backyard. After carefully rummaging through the box and with some help from historians, Dmitri learned that his box had belonged to a German soldier. The latter was fighting on the Eastern Front during the 1940s. Inside the box, there were a number of this soldier's personal possessions. The box had clothes inside and even what looked like a soldier's uniform. But there were other things, too. The soldiers placed a wallet in there, too, and it looked as good as new. The good condition of the wallet and of the other objects in there was thanks to the rubber seal of the box. This metal chest was perfectly sealed. This soldier knew what he was doing and he wanted to make sure that things were in good condition if he ever managed to come back for them. Historians love browsing through the chest. They even found money in the wallet and ID cards which proved that they belonged to a German soldier. When they analyzed the uniform, historians learned that this man must have been a doctor in the German Army's Corps of Medicine. They even learned that this man had the rank of captain. This soldier had equipped himself pretty well. The chest even had sweaters in there to help with the cold temperatures soldiers faced during the war. But there was even more. The soldier had packed up a few entertaining tidbits, too. There were two boxes of cigars in the metal chest and two bottles of rum, which were never enjoyed. I guess prolonged pleasure isn't always the best idea, is it?